The greatest strategy is spirituality and spiritual solutions. This is why. Before starting, I welcome you all with my love and respects and the blessings of my Guru, His Divine Holiness, Bhagwan Sri Nityananda Paramashiva. As beings who cognize themselves as humans, who are strongly associated to the thought currents of being human, we feel that we have to strategize more or less. Some of us feel more, some of us feel less, but we strategize our life a lot. And Swamiji is uh, showing us throughout this persecution, he's constantly saying, I am not strategizing, Kalabhairava is strategizing, I am just integrated to him. I, le I, let him handle the strat I let him handle the strategy. So I was contemplating on that and the click I got, the cognition I got is, Paramashiva is the pure consciousness. Kalabhairava is, is a form of Paramashiva. Paramashiva is the pure consciousness. The best strategy in life is awareness. And there's nothing more aware than Paramashiva. Paramashiva is the ultimate awareness. So surrendering to Paramashiva, deciding to love Paramashiva and surrender to Paramashiva is the best strategy. Because what is a strategy? Strategy is making a plan, knowing all information, as much information as possible. From that information, deciding what is your goal and this, depending on your goal, you will develop the path that you will take in order to achieve this goal as fast as possible. But the foundation of strategy is information gathering. The more you have information, the better strategy you can create. And the thing is that the more, how do you get more information? Well, more awareness. The more you are aware of things, the more you have information. So the more you become aware, the more your strategy becomes sharp and efficient. And there's nothing more aware than Paramashiva. There's nobody more aware than Paramashiva. Because Paramashiva is sitting inside of everything that exists and non-exists. And he has this information from everything because he is the source of everything. So he has the ultimate information. Therefore, he can strategize the best. So that is why a very simple strategy to live life is to surrender to Paramashiva and surrender to the Guru because Paramashiva comes in the life of a sincere seeker or a sincere devotee in the form of a Guru. And that is why surrendering to the Guru is so powerful. Um, guru is the embodiment of the unknown. Guru is the embodiment of Paramashiva. Swamiji is an incarnation of Paramashiva. When I say Guru, I refer to Swamiji. Why do I refer to Swamiji? means there's many people who can uh, decide to claim Guru but when you choose your guru, you should be, uh, you should make sure you're choosing someone who can guide you through, somebody who has the full experience. Otherwise, it might be a little bit more complicated. Now, um, Swamiji has proven that he has this through, uh, you know, surviving the persecution. Swamiji was saying, if I was human, I would have had mental breakdown, mental breakdown long time back. But luckily, I am unclutched and that is why I can handle all these attacks and character assassination and assass assassination attempts and everything. And um, so, so that is why uh, you choose your Guru and you surrender to that. Guru is the embodiment of the unknown. Surrendering to the Guru more and more is the path to allow for you to, um, to manifest the best strategy planning in your life because ultimately only Paramashiva knows the fastest way to get to something. So if you want to get anything in life, surrendering to Paramashiva should be your first option, your first decision. Surrendering, aligning to Guru should be the first decision. So that's a click I got, I wanted to share with you. Uh, tell me what you feel about that. Write a comment below if you had experience or if you had a click. Uh, of your own that you want to share and uh, if you have any questions as well write them down I do read them and I do answer them in other videos so uh, yes with this uh, subscribe like thank you very much for watching watch Swamji Satsang watch the description below a lot of interesting stuff uh, such as becoming a spiritual citizen of Sri Kailasa and much more so with this I'll see you in the next video thank you thank you thank you Nityananda